All right, guys, it has officially been one month on the carnivore diet. I was about to say keto diet, but one month on the carnivore diet, I am down 23 pounds. Not too bad, not too bad. And I've noticed some just like nice improvements. Uh, I was doing some video editing over on my gaming channel, and I've noticed that my face seems to be way less puffier, like cheeks aren't quite as large. So I feel like I lost a lot of weight in my face which is good to be for on camera when I'm uh, doing my streaming. So I'm pretty happy with that. And um, in the long run, I thought maybe on the carnivore diet, I would have been down maybe like 30 pounds in 30 days, but 23 pounds, not too bad, not too bad. Um, it's still work out uh, three days a week and I'm trying to aim for going for a fourth day of the week, trying to do some uh, running activities. I got some uh, army buddies going to be uh, helping me out with some cadence runs and whatnot, so yeah, I'm, I'm a, little, a little scared to get get back in the swing of that. <laughs> yeah, I'll do, do push-ups and everything else, but I don't know. So far, carnivore diet, once I added in a little bit of extra variety of like cheeses and like ham and some pork, I started enjoying um, the carnivore diet more than just strictly eggs steak and uh burgers uh yeah so far like a good secret weapon i find is sam's club a little sam's club i know a lot of people are like i don't use costco because costco is like two hours away and i'm not driving two hours to get some um good meat uh sam's club is rather close and you get a lot of good healthy meat for uh pretty cheap my opinion so I have found out one interesting thing with the uh, carnivore diet. I swear to goodness gracious, whenever you say that you're on a diet, everybody comes out of the woodwork, tries to take you out to eat or something like that. They see you wasted away and they're like, no, no, you need to, you need to come um, eat, eat this or eat that. And that's been a real struggle, real struggle. And um, let's see, uh, as of recording on this, uh, Mother's Day is next weekend. And I'll be taking my mother out and my mother-in-law out. And I think I might have some french fries. So am I done with the carnivore diet? No, no, I'm not done with it. I'm just taking an evening where I'm going to have some french fries with my uh, fish. Yeah, fish and chips, where the heck everybody calls it. I think a um, little bit of potatoes, a little once in a great while, not too bad. I'm not going to go like super strict uh, carnivore. Um, I'm going to throw in a couple ketogenic kind of things here and there kind of things or like little little things that I'll I like for example doing um, maybe once a month have some uh, french fries or like sushi I really enjoy uh, sushi rolls um, I have, so far on the carnivore diet I have not done uh, weight lot. I haven't gone out for Chinese food and I absolutely adore Chinese food um, or the American Chinese food because American Chinese food has way much, way more sugar than actual Chinese food. Anyway, <laughs> all right, guys, um, I'm at work right now. We're trying to get done with seed cutting here, and uh, we'll be out planting in the fields, guys. We are so close to the 500 sub mark that we need over on my gaming channel, Big Moto Gaming. If you haven't yet. Check that out over on uh, YouTube, and I think I need like 12 more subs, and then we'll finally hit, uh, what do you call it, YouTube partner. Uh, big, big milestone on my, my aspect. So that's what, we're, we're, we're gaming and grooving. And guys, I think we're going to be doing some Call of Duty action over on uh, Big Moto Gaming, and some World of Warcraft action, and obviously some Battlefield here and there kind of thing, so, oh, I'm just... I'm feeling good. I just feel like refreshed. 23 pounds, chat. Or chat. I'm not, I'm not live anywhere. Guys, all right. That's enough of me rambling. rambling. All right, hold on. Okay, give you the good old Moto salute. Let you know Moto is out. See you guys later. Bye-bye.